What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another amazing episode of our Pokemon Fire Red Randomized Nuzlocke. We are having a fantastic time with this series, although we did have a pretty major loss at the end of last episode. Now you may notice by the layout over here, uh, we have a new member with us. Uh, actually a revived member, so let's let's jump in really quick. Let's look at a, a quick party update. Yes, you are not mistaken. We have Garrett 2.0 here. Really, really stoked to have Garrett back on the team. Uh, we we did a coin flip, and we happened to get Garrett. It was either this or a Nidoking, uh, and I'll be honest, I'm kind of stoked to have Garrett back. I did decide to bring him back for a particular reason. Um, while we do have like Typhlosion as a pretty decent special attacker, overall, we don't really have something that's just going to go in there and like one-shot most things. Uh, it's obviously a bit of a glass cannon, but this does provide us with that. Uh, especially once we evolve it into an Alakazam, which should be viable because, again, we did change impossible evolutions. So, uh, I did decide to bring Garrett back. We trained up Garrett to level 36. Uh, just learned Psychic, so really, really putting the power down, but also has Psybeam, Confusion, and Future Sight as well. Not a very diverse moveset. We're going to hopefully find some TMs along the way and maybe change that, but... Obviously really happy to have Garrett 2.0 back on the team. Crimson is here, our level 38 Typhlosion with Tackle, Quick Attack, Flame Wheel, and Ember. Our highest leveled Pokemon, I believe, and just incredibly, incredibly powerful. Uh, super stoked to have that on the team. We have Panda, level 34 with Combine, Hidden Power, Confusion, and Brick Break. I know we are cross-typing uh, when it comes to Psychic with having Garrett and Panda on the team. But Panda very crucially checks dark type Pokemon, which we did not have a strong check for, I will say, prior. Uh, and so it's actually still really, really helpful to have both on the team. Uh, Quirk, our amazing Raichu, who we really put in the work with in the last couple episodes with Flash, Slam, Thunder Wave, and Thunderbolt. Uh, Ace, our starter, with Cut, Rock Tomb, Giga Drain, finally a very, very good move on uh, Ace, and then of course Mudshot. And finally, last but not least, Smurf, our Salamence, with Rage, Bite, Ember, and Headbutt. Still working on that moveset. We got a long way to go with some of these movesets, but overall, I'm really, really happy with our party. Uh, I know, like I said, we're, we're kind of doubling up on the Psychic type here, but I think it'll be okay. I think we're, we're fine. Now, in the last episode... Uh, if you happen to miss it, please go check it out, but we did clear out the Pokemon Tower, we went through, we released Marowak, lost a Pokemon along the way, which was sad, but, but, we are back. We're gonna jump into Saffron City today, uh, and potentially, uh, jump into the Fighting Gym. I haven't decided if we want to do that, or if we want to do the, uh, the, uh, Team Rocket stuff first. Uh, I'm kind of thinking today might just be, like, in episode one of today. Uh, I'm thinking it might just be that fighting gym, because I'll be honest, I'm a little scared of it. Um, I have looked at the levels, I know how good those Pokemon are, uh, and I'm very concerned. So, we'll see, uh, but I think we'll just go straight there, let's see what we do. We may jump into some of the uh, Team Rocket stuff, and you know what I, I kind of want to do, I want to make sure that we fight pretty much everybody in this one, so... Uh, let's do a couple things really, really quickly. We do not- we have the Lucky Egg on Garrett right now, so I'm thinking what we need to do, uh, is do this. Let's give Garrett the experience share, and then we're gonna give the Lucky Egg- whoops. We're gonna give the Lucky Egg to... let's give it to Smurf. Smurf really wants some good moves, <laughs> that's all I can say. Uh, and does take quite a lot of experience to, to fully uh, get there. So let's swap into Panda. Panda needs a little bit of experience here. Panda does have the choice band on it, so kicking some butt with Panda right now. But guys, I hope you're doing well. Make sure, uh, as always, if you would not mind, if you would please leave a like or a comment down below. If you're enjoying the series, if you're enjoying the videos, I really would uh, appreciate that. It means a lot. Small time creators like myself need that kind of thing. I just realized this is level 38. Oh, thank you for choice band. Um, <laughs> so, uh, we would greatly, greatly appreciate the support. It would mean very, very much to us. So please consider doing so. Carrot 2 getting some experience. Oh, and a golem. Yeah, we're staying in. We got this. We're just gonna brick break it. Uh, I am very worried about the levels on these Pokemon. Uh, we kind of have to do just the best possible move every single time and hope we can kind of 
get some one shot one shots in uh, or Oko's in. All right, first trainer is down. Let's jump over here. I guess we can fight. Can we fight two at the same time, or does that not work in this gym? Because we do have double battles in this game. We had one uh, on the previous route. By the way, uh, to train Garrett, uh, I did move over to uh, the other route and clear it out. So you saw us pass through there without hitting any trainers. That is why we were able to do that. Um, I think we go into Quirk here. A little worried about the level difference. I'm not going to lie. This is... This is some strong stuff, but disable, not gonna do a thing. So let's Thunderbolt. Let's do it. We got this. Not a problem. Oh, very close. Very, very close. Confusion. Okay, that's a little scary. Okay, well, that's fine. Um, also, guys, just to let you know, if you haven't already kind of picked up on the schedule, um, I think I talked about it one other time, but the idea is that we're trying to do 7 a.m. and then... Uh, 1 p.m. every single day with this series so you're getting two episodes every single day uh, I promise you for the next one we will have a more regular schedule up front uh, I know the first couple days were kind of off the wall the reason being this was really just like a random series to do so there was no real planning into it but whoa a crit holy crap um but uh, I do feel really, really good about the next series that I'm working on right now. Uh, we're working on graphics for it at the moment and trying to get things squared away there. Uh, and I could not be more excited. It's going to be a fantastic time. Uh, and I certainly hope you guys will join us. Obviously, we got a little ways to go. We're only about halfway through this game. Uh, but it's going to be a really fun time. Don't you worry. We are going to have a fantastic time. All right, let's get x out of here. Brick break. Let's go. Choice banded brick break from a panda. Easy. Easy one shot. Uh, I'm really, really hoping, by the way, we get Garrett to evolve here soon. Uh, it's level 36. I want to say it's like level 38, maybe 40, that uh, he actually evolves. Also, I'm not risking it, guys. Uh, we have had too many deaths for us to risk it, so we are going to go down <laughs> and heal up. I should also look around here because I don't know... Uh, I mean, I know we have the Team Rocket hideout to do, but I don't know, um, or excuse me, the Sylph Company, but I don't know if we have any, like, big HMs or anything like that to pick up here. I don't think we do. I think I know where most of those are at the very least. Um, so we'll see. Part of the reason also that I wanted to go through this gym, uh, was because we can get a free Pokemon at the end. I'm really excited about it, because uh, it could be anything. Uh, it could be a Wurple, or it could be a Mewtwo. Speaking of Mewtwo, I should have let everybody know, um, in that route that I was training on, <laughs> which was scary, um, there were two Mewtwo. Uh, thankfully, we were pretty high leveled. It didn't matter that much, but it was a little scary. Level 43. Okay, maybe this is a bad idea. Uh... I'm a little scared. Holy crap, level 43. That level modifier was a bad idea. Mistakes have been made. <laughs> I can't believe we made it out of that. Um, Garrett level 37. Oh, that was scary. I don't want to do that again. Um, that should be the worst that it gets, though. Yes, Garrett, this is it, my friend. Look at this. Look at this. All right. Let's get that Alakazam. Ooh, I love Alakazam. One of my favorite Pokemon. Definitely influenced my decision to put Garrett back on the team. <laughs> uh, but look at this. Look at this majestic Pokemon. Oh, oh, so happy. So happy. We now have an Alakazam. All right, uh, we may have to immediately swap out here, but I'm a little scared. We'll see what uh, what the opponent has. A little, a little worried. Level 37, uh, what are we worried about? Maybe Sturdy? Let's try. Let's try. This could be a mistake. Alright. Or it's not at all, and we just are amazing, and that's all there is to it. Alright, a Flygon. That's interesting. Um, I have no idea what is good against a Flygon, I am not gonna lie. That is a mistake, I should know that, and I don't. Definitely not Quirk. 
I'm just gonna give it a smurf, I think. I think it's kind of the safer bet. Um, I'm a little worried it might have a dragon type move, but I don't know by, by level up what it's gonna know. That intimidate should help at least a little bit. Let's headbutt it. See if we can flinch it. Okay, mistakes are made. I was kind of thinking it wouldn't have a dragon type move. I actually didn't do that much. Um, I just can't risk it though. We just don't have a great check for this, do we? We need a dragon type move. I'm gonna headbutt one more time. See if we can get the flinch. Yes, okay. We might have a chance then. We might have a chance. Flinched again. Oh, you amazing smurf you. Look at that. Um, I know that was a, a very scary switch in, but uh, I do think that was the right call. Uh, hmm. I really want to go into Panda. Let's see if we can one shot. I'm risking it today, guys. We're we're having some fun here today. If something dies, that's really terrible. But I don't want that to happen, and so we'll see. Uh, let's brick break. Okay, it's faster. That's scary. Can we one shot? Oh, so close. So close. Okay, let's swap out into Ace. Should be able to take most of the hits okay. Um, oh yeah, it lifts around anyway. We didn't even have to do that, but that's fine. Uh, we can just cut. <sighs> this is a scary gym. I don't like this gym. I don't like it at all. <laughs> Alright. Ace taken out this slack off. Alright, or slacking. Is it slack? Which one? Slack off is the little one. Oh yeah, we have a slack off. Alright, so the question becomes, do we risk it and go for the final uh, stage of this? I think what we're going to do is take a peek around the town first, because I'm a little worried. Let's heal up. If we do that, we are not leading with Panda. We are going to have to lead with something a little bit stronger, I think. Although, I will say, Panda put in the work. Um, absolutely. One-shotting everything with that Choice Banded Brick Break? Like, heck yes, let's go. Um, hey, what do you do? Don't say a word, you wanted this. Oh. Okay. That's good, I guess. I don't really need it, but... Well, actually, hold on. I could use it on Panda. Which doesn't seem like a bad idea. I think I'm gonna teach it to Panda. I think we're gonna do it. Yes. Which move should be forgotten? Uh... Let's just get rid of confusion, I think. Um, Calm Mind doesn't seem amazing, I know, but the boost that you get from it can be really, really helpful. So we'll, we'll see, we'll see. Um, but I think that that's the right call. Uh, that was helpful. TM for Psychic? Absolutely, I'll take it. All right, let's just walk through really quick again. I just don't remember if you can do that much at this point, but uh, since Team Rocket's all kind of here and doing their thing, let's check just really quick right here. I knew there was this house here, so I just want to make sure. Oh, this is uh, the dude's house. What's his name? A cool trainer one day. Absolutely. I think trainers are so cool when they're battling. Don't you think so, too? I do. Okay. We'll just, we'll just, uh, exit here. Um, I'm really tempted to lead with Crimson. Actually, let's lead with Smurf. I think we're gonna lead with Smurf. We'll throw that out there, and we'll see how this goes. I am nervous as crap, though. Uh, but we can get a free Pokemon. Like, I think it's worth it. I, I don't know, guys. This is scary. Um... Because I know what level they are going to be, and it's not good. No. No. Oh gosh, no. Here we go. Here we go, guys. Alright, I'm gonna ember it. See if we can get a burn. God, that does nothing! Absolutely nothing. Okay, um... 
All right, check this. We got this. Not even worried about it. Calm mind, let's go. Oh crap, we're choice banded. Oh my gosh. Why? Why did I even do this? Oh, I'm an idiot. He can't use it. He can't use anything other than calm mind. <laughs> Alright, let's go to Quirk. We're gonna Thunder Wave this thing. Try and get it paralyzed so that at the very least there's a chance that it doesn't actually hit. Uh, please work. Yes. Oh, thank you, Quirk. Quirk also has Shockwave, which can't miss, uh, which is also pretty handy here. And we are going to stay in and go for that Shockwave, I think. Um, or no, we didn't learn shock. I thought we did. Oh, I'm thinking... Oh, sad day. I'm thinking Max. We're going to stay in here. Try and use up and burn these sleep turns. Uh, because on the off chance we need Quirk later as well, I do not want to have to switch in with it asleep. Uh, this is very risky. God, wake up, Quirk. Please, please. This may be all we do this episode, guys. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, we can go for one more, I think. Yeah. God, oh, it does nothing. Okay. That means we can go for another, so that's fine. No, don't miss! No! Oh, no. No, please don't. Oh! Perfect! God, that still does a lot. Um... One more. Try to get as much damage with Quirk off as I can, and then that way when we do switch him, we can kind of finish it off. Yes. Come on, Quirk. Come on. Ha! Ha ha! Alright. No, Quirk! You can do this! So glad I... No, Quirk! Come on. Ugh. Not good. Um, we have to do it. We have to brick break it. That's all we can do. We have to brick break it. Perfect. Oh, Quirk, you gem of a Pokemon. Please just one shot this. Thank you. Oh. Clefable is the bane of my existence. For those of you who don't know or haven't watched previous episodes, uh, just absolutely terrible, terrible Pokemon. Uh, stop learning Psych Up. Yeah, we're not gonna learn it. All right, should have one more Pokemon, I believe. Quirk got to level 36. I like that. A Seeking. Unfortunately, Quirk is asleep, so we're gonna go to Ace because we do have Giga Drain on him, and should be able to take this thing out. God, still level 30 or 44 though. That does nothing! <laughs> Crap. Okay, but thankfully this is doing absolutely nothing to us as well. So that's a positive. Let's just keep going for Giga Drains. We just have to. Uh, this may be a bit of a shorter episode, guys, like I said, but that's okay. I think we're gonna have a good time. It's gonna be great. Whoa, swerve. Um... Because next time is going to be a pretty action-packed episode. We may start on it a little bit. Uh, just so we can guarantee we get through it all. Because um, there is a lot to do in that area. There's a lot of trainers. Um, lots of stuff we can do. So I think we will kind of jump into it for just a few minutes. Try and clear out some of the trainers. And then that way, uh, once we get into the Sylph Company, we can really, really finish it up strong. Alright. Get it out of here. Not even a problem. Alright. Uh, what level are these Pokemon gonna be? I don't know. Alright. Perfect. That was a scary, scary gym battle. <laughs> Let me just say, I know this isn't a... Oh, an Eevee. Oh, I do like Eevee. Or a Vulpix. Both of them are pretty good. I think the right call is Eevee. Uh, I do need to pull up, I'm sorry, I should have, uh, planned ahead a little bit, but I did not, uh, pick up a username, so let's do this. Let's get, 
you out here let's go find a commenter because i know we did have a number of you guys comment so thank you guys so much for leaving those comments down below uh and giving us some some exciting names to choose from i think it's fun to do that i think it's fun to name them after you guys uh all right great episode do 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 george i think george george has been here like for a very long time so let's do that uh, George the Eevee. I really like that. Make me, let's make sure I'm spelling it as they have spelled it. George, thank you so much. You've commented on most of the videos. I really do appreciate the support. Uh, and so we had to, we had to get something in there for you. All right, let's go heal up and let's start. I'm not going to swap out for Eevee at the moment. I don't think we need to. Um, but I do want to start in on the Sylph Company here and uh, start cleaning Team Rocket out of here. Nobody wants them. Nobody even cares about them. Um, all right. Perfect. All right. Let's go, guys. Let's do this. Ah, man. What a nerve-wracking, nerve-wracking thing. All right. Sylph Company, here we go. Like I said, we're not going to worry about getting through the Sylph Company today. What we're going to worry about doing is clearing out some of the trainers that we know are here. Uh, because there are quite a bit. Smurf out front, I think that's fine. And just getting a gauge also for the levels, because I actually have not looked at the levels of these uh, at all. Unknown. <laughs> okay. Level 30? Easy. That's not a problem at all. Probably should have done this first realistically, but... Eh. It's fine. We took it down. Our team is too good. Too good, too good. Alright. Surf getting some experience. Garrett 2.0. Level 38. Man, so good. A Quagsire. Uh, we'll go out into Ace and we'll Giga Drain it. Easy enough. Uh, we do have to make sure we kind of kill this thing quick though. Uh, because it's obviously pretty good against us, too. This should do a pretty sizable chunk of damage, if not, yeah, one-shot it. Easy. Easy enough. Alright. Ace does need to get some experience, too, so I'm glad that we're, we're using Ace a little bit here. Uh, let's get Crimson out. Crimson can take this no problem. Look at this. That flame wheel. I love it. Um, I kind of want a variety of moves on Crimson, and I don't know what the moveset can be for him. So, we'll see. A Crawdont. Uh, Quirk, let's, let's take care of this real quick. Could also have gone out into Panda, and again, that's the importance of Panda, is that fighting type gives us the opportunity... Ah, seriously? Um... <laughs> That fighting type gives us that opportunity to take out dark types, which we normally cannot. Uh, I mean, we just don't have a good answer for them. It's not like we have a bug type or anything like that. I did think about swapping Panda um, or bringing in, instead of Garrett, uh, our Scyther. Uh, because we do have a very nice Scyther sitting in the box, and it would be a really cool Pokemon to evolve, but I'm pretty sure in the game we need that Metal Coat still. While we don't need to trade it, we do have to uh, level it up with that. We just don't have one yet. If we do, I would consider swapping them out because a, a, a Scizor on the team would do amazing. A Scyther, it's hit or miss. It's good typing. It's not bad for us, but I just don't think it's like really what we want. Um, if we can get a Scizor, I'm all for it. And that would also check dark types uh, because it is part bug. And so we can kind of finish them off that way, which is really nice. So we'll see. We will see what the lock has in store for us. Uh, certainly a lot of a lot of potential coming down the line. <laughs> Alright. Uh, we're just going to bite this. Level 35, that's actually pretty strong. Um, that's a little scary. Okay. Uh... Yeah, that's fine. So is this actually... Yeah. Okay. Oh! Well, that's a little scary. We might die. No, no, no! All 
All right. Why did I think staying in was a good idea? I knew it was ice type. I knew it was gonna have a nice move. I thought I could kill it. Not Smurf. Smurf was like really, really powerful. I mean, his moveset was kind of garbage, but... <sighs> Just... One episode. I just wanted to go one episode without losing anything major, although the last- I think we were fine the last couple episodes, but I just didn't want to lose- No, we lost a Pokemon in the last episode. I just didn't want to lose another one. It's fine. I made a dumb tr that was on me! I made a dumb call. It was Ice-type, and I stayed in, and it- that was stupid. I think after this battle we're gonna end this episode. <laughs> We're gonna go heal up and uh, deposit Smurf. And we'll find out in the next episode what our new party will look like. Uh, and we will have probably trained up a little bit as well because we do need to. Is there an item or anything down here? I don't wanna fight anybody. No items. I am an idiot. That's my takeaway. I can't believe I did that. I cannot believe I stayed in. There was no point. We have Crimson. Why would we have stayed in? Why? Why do I do this to us? Alright, first things first. Let's take the item. Smurf. I am sorry. This is completely on me. I did a dumb thing, and here we are. But you know what? It's okay. It's okay. You will be forever remembered. Thank you, Smurf, for being an amazing member of the team. Let's look at our team really quick while we have a second. So I do think it's actually between Scyther. Marta, or Scyther, actually seems really fun. Or Parish the Shuppet, which would also be kind of interesting. I don't know. I will see what my heart desires when we get into the next episode. But guys, thank you so much. Let's heal up really quick and let's finish off this this episode. We made it through the toughest gym we have faced yet. And then this happens. Here we are. It is what it is. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Hope you have a fantastic day. Don't forget to stay tuned for the second episode today coming out hopefully around 1pm. Uh, but until then... Thanks a lot, guys. I'll talk to you in the next one.